Robert E. Lee said they never should have been up in, in the first place because they, su they sustained the pain of the war. He, he was not buried in a Confederate uniform and didn't want a flag on his gravesite. These uh, Confederate so soldiers or generals represent uh, the attempt to overthrow our government. They represent secession and slavery and, and sedition and segregation. And to sustain that uh, legacy is a bad thing. There are no uh, swastikas on the, uh, in the statues of that sort in Germany. They wanted to heal the wounds of war. Mm -hmm. So the federal government should decide and dictate rather than having communities decide whether or not. I mean, normally this would be a community decision about whether or not they should stay or go. Well, it, it could be a community. For example, in Baltimore, the mayor, the mayor simply moved by, by night and, and removed those statues. Uh, they should be removed everywhere. Because it's an insult to America's dignity. I mean, if they, if they had won, we would not be the United States of America. We'd be hooked up with Britain and France and another country uh, to the south of uh, to, to the south, the 13 southern states. They lost an attempt to overthrow our government. You can't be more insulting than that. How far would you go? Would you go, for example, the battlefield of Gettysburg, where there are commemorations to every state where everyone lost, where every state where they lost soldiers? Soldiers. Well, I think there's a combination here. One is that. We want to heal. The, the reason why Lincoln uh, pardoned so many was trying to heal the wounds of war. And Lee, Lee matched him by saying, if Lincoln would pardon us, we should at least not try to put it in his face by having satchels to this war, which had no legitimacy ultimately. Uh, and I think that these statues uh, and uh, the flags and even the uh, Electoral College legislation should all come down. We should go forward by a kind of, I think that Heather Heyer is. It represents the healing of the Union. Robert E. Lee represents secession. And her statue should be up. Right. You're on record at how displeased you were with the president's response. Let me ask you a more direct question. Do you think President Trump is racist? No, I think he's pitiful. And I think we deserve out of him better. Uh, the White House is in chaos. And while we focus a lot on President Trump, I think the real issue now is, is Jefferson Beauregard Davis uh, uh, Sessions. Uh, his attempt to undermine uh, uh, the Voting Rights Act by choosing voter fraud over voter suppression, uh, his focus on privatizing prisons, uh, his focus on uh, using money as designed to chase down militarized Nazis uh, to anti-affirmative action, the, uh, the agenda of anti-civil rights, anti-Planned Parenthood. The agenda continues even though the distraction is around Trump's tweets. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.